This is Mr. Romju Raksaf, legal advisor, Galo Eastern Union. And this is Mr. Romju Leader, Vice President Protocol, Galo Eastern Union. <coughs> so, <coughs> Galo Eastern Union series of memorandum representation uh, government was summit karne ke baad aaj national press club mein <coughs> three point memorandum ka sath aaya hai government ko <coughs> three point memorandum ka sath aaj galo student national press club mein aaya hai first jo hai first point jo hai issue of notification and immediate function of science stream at doni polo government from kampi college ye mera hum ko first demand hai uh, issue of notification and immediate function of science stream at Tony Polo Government College Company. And second point here immediate granting video power to principal government model college company. Here is my second point here. Or my third point here immediate functionalization and Extension of RGU campus at Doni Polo Government College Kamke. So, ye as three point memorandum ka saath Galo student ablu ka press club mein aaya hai. So, ham thanks dena chahta hai Kamke Welfare Society ko, jo ki science stream or RGU extension ke liye available land donate karke rakha hai. So, udhar science stream or RGU extension ke liye koi land ka koi issue nahi hai. Kampi Welfare Society का available land donate करके रखा है और ये मेरा three point को अभी मेरा legal advisor हम request करेंगे कि मेरा legal advisor को विस्तारी से इसको आप explain करें Galo Student Union as said by the General Secretary of Galo Student Union has placed three point representation from ultimatum to the government of Arunachal Pradesh led by Honorable Emma Kandu government. Galo Student Union has being the FX Student Union of Galo Society has taken education as a very serious note and Galo Society has been Galo Student Union has been going on educational tour for last four to five months. In regards to that Galo Student Union has taken note of the various difficulties that are being faced by the Galo students as a whole. So in that regards, Galo Student Union has submitted a representation. Number one was, as said by the General Secretary Jumrik Bagra, is for the immediate extensions of, uh, for the immediate functionalization of extension of Rajiv Gandhi campus at Government College Kampu that falls under Kamba circle. In this regard, for the functionalization, a representation was submitted, first representation was submitted in 8 December 2023. Thereafter again as a reminder, on 27 February 2024, the government getting no response from the government, Galo Student Union submitted second representation. Thereafter, seek they submitted again on 11th July and met the Commissioner Education also in person. And also in this regard, the Galois Student Union had met Minister Education twice or thrice. Now, in this regard, why the importance of functionalization of this RGU campus at Don Polo Government College Kampu is required is because the Kanku, though it sounds as a, so, so, though the issues are being taken up by the Galo Student Union, Kanku, Doni Polo Government College, Kanku accommodates students from various districts, various adjoining districts, and the periphery of the, uh, of Kanku area under Weishek districts, like Siyomi, uh, Siang, Isiang, even from Upper Shibon Sri, district, various students used to come to come, come to for educational purpose. So the government has taken up a proposal for extension of RGU campus since the RGU at present is uh, required for the extension. So 
our DPGC college campus was selected and we wholeheartedly welcome it and the area people has donated enough land. But now the said RGU ex extension is yet to be functionalized. And the second point that the Ga Galo Student Union is demanding is for the establishment for the functionalization of science stream at government college Kamku. This I would through you all the media friends, I would let you know the public of entire Arunachal Pradesh is that in the year 2014, already the infrastructure, the buildings, etc., has been constructed in the Kamku College. And it was inaugurated, if I'm not wrong, by the Honorable Minister Sri Kiran Rijuju at that time. Now, though the infrastructure is there and ready to be functionalized, yet the science stream is to be notified and the academic of the science stream has to be started yet. So, for the sake of the student as a whole, for the sake of the entire Weixiang district students and all the periphery adjoining, periphery district, we the Dalo Student Union are demanding for the immediate starting, immediate functionalization of science stream at DPGC College Kamke. Now DPGC College Kamke is only giving the eco educational courses of BA uh, become. So the student, there are ample number of students who belong from a marginalized society, who belong from the uh, backward classes and from below poverty family. So, in order to pursue science, they have to go out of the out of the district, like in Itanagar or in other states. They have to go. They have to uh, uh, take rent for accommodation if they don't get the hostel facilities. So, the students who wants to study science stream at their nearest door are not getting their rights. So, though the science stream all the infrastructure has been constructed, yet the science, is science stream is yet to be functioned. This demands that the Galois Student Union is being demanding to the uh, state government. And the third point the Galois Student U Union is emphasizing is in regards to government model college Basar, which was established in the year 2015 by the gazetted notification. Now, government college Basar is accommodating more than 1,000 students every academic year. But the sad part of the story is that the principal of that institution is yet to get DDO power. And without DDO power being granted to the principal of a very uh, large organization, a large institute like Government Model College, it has affected the administrative functioning of the college. And without DDO power at its hand, for every penny, for every expenditure, exp petty expenditure expenses, they have to rush to the deputy commissioner's office and because of which the development and the upliftment of the government model college country is, is still at hand and it needs immediate look into. So because of the no need of power, there are no manpower like various manpower multitasking stuff, there, there is deficiency of such stuff also. Since the stock was taken by the GSU while encouraged to edu educational too. Now, these are the three points that the Galois Student Union has placed in front of the government of Arunachal Pradesh. Since last 2023, that is now almost one year, Galois Student Union feels it necessary that being a student organization, we need to prioritize 
the education system the education sector of our society so all the demands all the three point demands pertains and it directs to the education system only so these issues are if we look it very seriously these issues are not an impossible task for the pema led government and we galo student union also has a high hope and believe that under the dynamic leadership of honorable pema kandu this all the demands will be met up as soon as possible but we also make it very clear that though we support the government for the betterment for better development of the state as a whole but if the voice of galo student union and if the voice of galo as a whole is not taken into consideration the genuine demands are not met up will resort to democratic movements very soon so this is the ultimatum to the government we believe that under the leadership of pd shona the education minister and honorable cm this issue will be resolved very soon since this issues involve entire arunachal pradesh this is the demand of the galo student union and this was the reason for calling of this press briefing and in this regard we are giving one more ultimatum as a legitimate time is required so we are giving one more <coughs> ultimatum to the state government to redress our demand if failure in fulfilling our demand within months will resort to democratic movements that might be any kind of forms that will announce later on